This video will demonstrate how to cross probe and place components between Design Entry Sys and Allegro PCB Editor. You can cross probe or cross select between Allegro Design Entry Sys or ORCID Capture with the PCB Editor tool. For this, you must enable Inner Tool Communication in Design Entry Sys. Select the options from the menu bar and select Preferences. From the Preferences dialog box, select the Miscellaneous tab. Under Inner Tool Communication, you must enable the Inner Tool Communication option. The PCB Editor and Allegro Design Entry Sys can cross probe only if the netlist from the schematic is imported into the layout. The schematic and the design must be in sync. Go to Tools, Create Netlist. Select the Netlist Files directory as the Project folder. Select OK to generate the netlist. Now the netlist has been generated in the Project folder. Import the netlist into the Allegro PCB Editor. Go to File, Import, Logic slash Netlist. Select the import logic type as Design Entry Sys and choose the import directory. Go and select the project directory as the netlist import directory where we have the netlist. Select import. Go and check the status. You can see the unplaced symbols are 82 and unrouted nets are 181. Go to place, quick place, set the placement filter to place all components around package keeping, and the placement side selected as top. Select the Place button. Now you can see all the symbols placed on the top side of the board. Place the schematic window and PCB window side by side in the monitor. From the schematic first page, select the component you want. In the layout you can see U1 gets highlighted and brought into focus in the Allegro PCB editor. Set the application mode to placement edit and the find filter to select symbols only and select a component in the layout. You can see the selected component gets highlighted in the schematic. Now we have created a live connection between the schematic and the PCB editor. Selecting parts in the schematic selects the footprints in the PCB editor. The items you can cross probe between schematic and layout are components, nets, and pins. With this cross select feature, you can place components using the move command, go and select the move button in PCB editor. While in Schematic right-click, drag, and select Components in Allegro Design Entry Sys. In the PCB Editor, the component gets selected. You can pick a selection point common to the selected components using your mouse. The component selected will take that point as reference and move with reference to the selection point as you how you move your mouse cursor. After selecting the Move command, right-click, select Temp Group and select those components you want to move in Layout. After selecting all the components, you want to move, go to Layout, right-click, select Complete and choose your center point to move the selected components. This way you can move specific groups. The cross-select feature can also be controlled in PCB layout at two places. The first place is at Setup, User Preferences menu, User Interface, Sprobe, if you change the variable for Allegro underscore no underscore Sprobe to yes disables cross probing, or if you set the variable as, except project manager, the cross probing will work only, if you invoke the tools from the project manager. The second place where you can set the cross probe is, go to, set up the enable the cross probing option, will be present. If you disable this option, cross probing will be disabled in the PCB editor. That concludes the demo of using the cross probe function and place components between Allegro Design Entry Sys and Allegro PCB Editor.